Hello, Crafts and Creators. So, hello. Today, we are back with a how to build thingy. It's there, there. We are uh, starting back with a how to build a gurky sandwich. No, I'm joking. So, I'm just bored. After posting that Roblox video, so I decided, how about, so yeah, first I, first I showed you how to make this thing, the Senor Taco, now, I'm going to show you how to make, drum roll, clunky, wait, um, okay. It's gonna be brrrr, brrr, roller coaster. I wanna show you how to build a roller coaster that actually might go into my theme park if it is a success. So we've already made two roller coasters there, which is actually kind of bad, and we're over there, which is kind of bad. So I'm not gonna try a new one. Now all you need is best to. All you need to do is mess up. All you need to do is get a wood of your choice. I'm using this one. And then get a wood of, then get a fence of your choice. Most likely the same color that your wood was. To make it, you know, kind of better looking. Then you're going to want to, not Riz. Push one button, guys. No. Ah. Rail. Then you're going to need, um. A rail, power rail, that's, that's it. And then, um, then you need a redstone torch. Okay, so you're gonna want to start the ride in a clear area. So I suggest a flat world, or at least some something that is a small area in one of your worlds. And that's when you build this, Oops, wrong button. Then you let it start to go up. That's when you put three of these under and make it go higher each time. So the so you start at the bottom, place three blocks. Then make it go up to this one. Then one more up, and but keep the fence underneath it. Then what you want to do is you're going to want to place the wrong blocks. No. Then put that there. Only two, though. Actually, make it three. Three redstone, uh, red, the, these blocks, power rails. Then you have to keep making it taller. 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 And taller. Which would be... Also, uh, get rid of these things underneath it. So it would be one, two, three, four, five, six wood, wood blocks of your choice. Then you will put the fence underneath it, and then you will fall onto the ground. Whoop! Oh, you finish. I'm joking. All right. Then you just want to bring the fence down to the ground. And keep doing that with each one that you place. Now, this might take a while because, you know, it's fence. It's kind of hard to do. Kind of hard to place. Kind of. But with me, it is. And it's also hard for me to fly. <laughs> really? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Alright. Then you build this last. Then you put the, bring this last fence down. Now it doesn't have to stop, but then you're going to want to bring up the rails like so. And to give it the best riding experience, make it spin, like make it turn around like that. And then 
turn again that way and just make it keep turning. So you don't, you're like, did I seriously disconnect it? Whoop. So it's like, you don't know when it's going to stop. Okay, you do that. Whoops. There. Then you let it go along the tracks like that. Then you're going to place one block in front of it and then make it turn. Which also, which, but that follows, each block you put, always put the fence underneath. Because, I don't know why, but I just, I just like rides that are, that have these fences with them. I have no idea why though. I just, it was fun for me. So yeah. Or you can, um, you could bring all your fences out now, or you could do it the other way, which is build the whole thing and put the fences out at the last, the last part. But I don't really care which one you do. Just saying, that might be faster for anyone who just wants to, you know, hurry up the roller coaster. Alright, almost done guys, don't worry. Don't freak out or anything. Why am I sounding like Miranda? Alright. Then, bring it down. Then, sh Right up. And just poke these ones off. So yeah. Then, you make it turn again. And then, you might, and then you might as well want to make it drop down three blocks. So, to have a good writing experience. Then, make the right turn. Because, I mean, who would have saw that coming? I didn't see that I'd be messing it up coming. Okay. And then, it's going to turn. Put one activator rail. And, just... Make it do that. Place those blocks. One, two, three. Basically three on each side. Oops. And then make it go forward, backwards. And then let make it turn. So that's your ride so far. If your ride looks like this so far, then you're doing it well. Then all you need to do is make it just, you know, do this a couple of times. Well, okay, and you're gonna wanna make it move away from that and make it keep turning. Just, you know, make it drop down like a normal roller coaster would. Now, you can end your ride there, which is just up, spin, down, turn, 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 down. Or, you could do a bit more things. Which I know I'm gonna do. So next, you would make it go. Wait, what? Say it connects. Next, you will make it turn. Go behind the ride. I mean, I just think this would be a cool thing to add with your ride. 
They can go in there. And then, well, I get trapped, you know, what you always want to do. Because if you don't do that, you fail. Then it goes up. Um, 